Okay, I accidentally went back to Kmart and I got some stuff. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, hi. Welcome back to yet another Kmart haul. This is my third one, I think. We're developing a little bit of a problem here. Bit of a series, you know, of um, I can't control my shopping habits. Thank you for supporting it. If you live under a rock and you don't know, basically Kmart have just brought out this beautiful range of really aesthetic and really beautiful decor. Now I can't wait to show you guys the items that I've got today, but there were also some items that I couldn't get my hands on because they sold out so quickly like there was no way for me to get these items as much as I wanted them and as much as I was craving them I couldn't get them because they're sold out so if you guys would like a part two to this video don't forget to give me a like and subscribe down below I mean I'm gonna do it anyway because we love Kmart here Kmart is but I still have some goodies to show you guys like this is just the basket I've also got a little box to show you here so there's still some goodies to show you today which I will get into right now this now if we just get rid of the ugly ass flowers attached to it which i will definitely figure out a way to do so i reckon some pliers will be able to rip these baddies out oh god they're molting like crazy you're too ugly to be doing that we have a beautiful vase that is just I love all things wavy and curvy and just asymmetrical. I love this so much. She is stunning, but she's got these ugly ass flowers in the top that I'm definitely going to get rid of as soon as I can. I just thought you cannot go wrong. As I say, every Kmart haul video, you can't go wrong. Side note, I literally just pulled the flowers out with my bare hands because... Oh my god, I love that. Now you can see the real beauty without any distractions. Look how gorgeous she looks. Now that I've got flower dust literally everywhere, okay, let's talk about this. And it was only like $2.50 on clearance, so I was like, it would be rude not to. So this is the speckled hanging wall planter. I don't have anywhere to put this. I don't even have a hole in my wall to put this in. Maybe I can make one. We're going to take it out of the box, have a look at it. Ooh. Oh my god, I love that so much. Stop. It's bigger than I expected. I don't know what I was expecting. Let's get it out of the bubble wrap, but first. I instantly see herbs, like maybe some basil or some coriander popping out of this bad boy. Like just imagine having these in your kitchen with your little herbs sticking out. Oh my gosh. I wish I had a kitchen that could cater for this right now. Oh my god. I would throff. It's textured. It's got that like a really rough stony texture to it, which I like. My hands are kind of grossed out by it though. I just feel like you couldn't. I'm gonna say it again. I'm not going to say that anymore in this video. I'm not gonna say it. Maybe you could just have it as a decor piece, just kind of chilling just like that on your table or something. Okay, enough decor for a second. I actually went out and got a bike short set because I really want to get into walking again. It's been a while since I've been a bit active, so I really want to try and motivate myself again. No other way to do that than to buy a fresh active wear set. I don't know what the logic is behind that. But if you buy a fresh active wear set, you get motivated, you know, like you want to wear that. So these are the bike shorts here. They're just called mesh bike shorts in the white. They're only $15. $15 for bike shorts? Are you kidding me? So I haven't actually put them on yet, so I don't know if they're entirely see-through or not. Mm, you should be okay. They have little pouches on the inside there as well, so you can pop in like your AirPods. I don't know what else you take to gym that's like tiny, but just something in there. And it has a little mesh triangle at the bottom of the short as well, just to kind of give some air in, you know, a bit of airflow. And then this is the top, just a simple white crop. I thought it was super nice. It's got the breathable mesh at the back there as well, so it matches the bike shorts. This is just called Mesh Crop White, and this was $13. Okay, so this is the set. <laughs> Voila. I did get a size 8 in the bottoms and a size 6 in the top, which is my usual size, but I'm actually feeling quite constricted and out of breath right now, so I'm going to have to get a size up in both of them. I love the style, you know, she's very nice, very flattering. Like, it's a little bit see-through in the bottoms, but that's expected because it's only Kmart. These were only $15. But yeah, I'm super happy. Like, I like it. I just need to size up because I feel like I'm being constricted. Whew. I can't breathe, I can't digest, I can't function. Blood flow stopped. Okay, let's talk about this cute bathroom set for a second. I wasn't actually going to buy these, but then I saw a TikTok. I really love gold. So as soon as I saw that this was gold at the top, I was like, 
we're done. We're done. It's such a beautiful gold as well. Like it's not like a brassy, warm toned gold. It's very gorgeous. I love it. You can pop a bunch of random stuff in this and it will look super cute. It's textured to give that, you know, unique feeling about it. This is called the white textured tumbler and this is called the white textured soap dispenser. They also had a matching toilet brush, but I didn't really need a new toilet brush. So I left that. Although now that I think about it, I kind of want it. Maybe that'll be in my next haul. You'll have to find out. Okay, let's get the big box out of the way because it's staring at me and I can't handle it anymore. The viral TikTok mirror right in my lap. I couldn't believe it. It was the last one on the shelf. I'm so happy I got this. Out of everything, I'm happy that we got the mirror because look at that. Oh, what is that? I'm not sure what that is. But anyway, I just touched it. I might die. Who knows? The scalloped circular mirror. This has been going viral on TikTok for the last couple of weeks now. Love the look of this. Kmart have really upped their game with mirrors at the moment. Like they've got a beautiful arched mirror. They've got like a full length mirror as well. And they don't cost an arm and a leg, which is amazing. Here we go. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my God, it's so precious. I love it. That is so gorgeous. Oh my God. This is the best Kmart purchase I have ever bought. You can hang this as well. It's got a tiny little hanger at the top there, but I'm honestly just probably gonna lean this somewhere. The border of this mirror is really good quality as well. So this is definitely the best purchase I have bought from Kmart. All right, we've still got some goodies to go. So we're not done yet. I feel like it's not a Kmart haul if I don't buy bowls. <laughs> what is wrong with me? I don't even live in my own home yet, but here I am buying bowls. These bowls are called the Sable Small Bowl. And I thought that was the cutest little bowl for like a little snack, you know, some ice cream and some fruit, you know, just, I don't know why that was the first thing that came to my head. It's what I imagined when I see this bowl. I love it. I couldn't go past it. I brought a candle. Look at him. He's so cute. This is called the arch shaped pillar candle. I feel like you could pop this on your side table or your hallway table, wherever, and it'll just be a nice little addition to your area. Like, it's so cute. I love candles like this. I have a candle in the shape of like a woman's body. And I also have one of those like bubble candles as well. They're really cool. Emma, what have you done to my hair? But I don't have an arch candle. I thought I could add this to my collection, which I love so dearly. I love the color. I love that it's not scented. Like it's just a candle. It's decor, baby. And it looks amazing. Hey, Ma, what have you done? You have seriously changed the game here. My boyfriend ended up getting this for himself. He was like, oh, I want this for my desk. And I thought he was joking. But here it is in my basket. So like, I don't mind it, but it's not my style. I really like the plants. They don't look too artificial. You know how sometimes you get really artificial looking plants? For example, <laughs> but from afar, you wouldn't know the difference. You know, like this is super cute. It kind of reminds me of like a little boat. But yeah, I like it. Not as much as my boyfriend likes it though. Now this was my choice. You know what? I thought this would be perfect for like your keys or loose jewelry or random stuff you can just pop in there and kind of forget about until you need it. Once again, the waviness, the texture. Obviously I had to get this. Oh, it looks like a flower from this direction. Couldn't go wrong. Couldn't. I've said it. But yeah, I love this little bowl. I'm really impressed with Kmart's bowls this year. Like what have they done? 2023 is the year for Kmart. We got another wobbly item. Ooh, this one feels really weird on the hands. Once again, it's unique. It's asymmetrical. It's wavy and wobbly. And it also has a mark there, but that's okay. That's fine. Oh, <laughs> this is called the curved object. I don't know how they came up with that name. Just another decor piece that you can pop somewhere to make your area kind of groovy, kind of cool. Not much to say about this little guy other than he's super cute, but he feels really weird. And that is all I got from Kmart this time. If you guys would like a part two, don't forget to like and subscribe down below so you can let me know because I would love to do a part two. You know I love going to Kmart and spending all of my savings, so let's keep that going. Anyway, guys, I'm going to love you and leave you. I will see you in my video on Sunday. So, ciao for now.